I've got this huge blinding light right in my eye. <sighs> and now I can't see anything. So it's shone right in my eye. <sighs> anyway, hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Adelaine. Thank you for clicking on this video. If you're new here, then please subscribe and yeah i'm just gonna get straight into it so today's video i am going to be doing a massive sisters and seekers haul now before i carry on i do realize that i have uploaded three hauls previously to this video and i don't really have a reason why to be quite honest i've just been really into looking at clothes buying clothes thinking about clothes wanting to talk about clothes so yeah it's just so happened that i've been uploading a lot more a lot of hauls but if you do have any ideas of what you'd want to see from my channel or what you'd want to see from me then i'd really really appreciate it if you could leave a comment down below and let me know what you'd want to see from me because i'm definitely open to seeing what you would want to see from my channel so yeah leave a comment down below if you have any ideas for me but yeah i have got another haul for you guys so in my previous video i had i think it was three items from sisters and seekers and they were my first ever three items from them and i really love them like i really really love them if you haven't watched that haul then go check it out it's the huge haul and then i have pieces from sisters and seekers ex friends asos so yeah, go check that out if you haven't seen it already. But yeah, in that haul, I did talk about a few pieces from Sisters and Seekers. And then they have just brought out a new collection, which is absolutely massive. They have so many pieces in this collection. So I thought that I would purchase myself some pieces. Now... Some of the pieces I loved and I was like, I definitely want them. Some of the pieces I kind of just wanted to see how they would fit on me. So like trousers, for instance, they I've never been able to get a pair of trousers that fit right from the get go. I've always had to get bigger and alter them. So things like that, I kind of wanted to just try and see what it actually looked like on and and kind of review it for you guys which also brings me on to say i've realized that filming my hauls and doing these youtube videos i've noticed that i personally don't really watch any youtubers hauls that have the same body shape as me so i'm quite short i'm five foot one and i'm like a size 12 so i'm like a short bigger girl i mean i'm not massive but i'm like not i'm not the skinniest person i've got roles like do you know what i mean like i'm not the skinniest person out there and i never watch people like i don't think i've watched anyone of my size do a clothing haul or nor do i subscribe to anyone of like any there probably are loads of channels out there that have the same have a similar body shape to me but i'm just saying like I don't really watch many people or anyone that has the same body type as me. So I feel like, especially in my Girl Knows All haul, I helped a lot of people with knowing what sizes to get. Um, I had a, so many questions of like, what, how tall are you? What size do you usually get? And a lot of the feedback was that I really helped them knowing what size to get when they went and got their, their bit. So I... Well, it felt like I was really helping people and I feel like that is what's like encouraging me and pushing me to do more hauls because I feel like I'm helping people, whether it's just one person or 10 people, I feel like I'm helping people. I'm literally rambling so much right now, but I just wanted to say that I'm doing this haul to kind of just get a general feel of how... The pieces fit on my body shape and also just because i absolutely love this collection so with that being said i went online and i literally dropped in my basket every single thing that i loved plus a few things that i was intrigued to try and i ended up buying i 
think it was about 11 pieces which came up to like over 400 pounds <laughs> but yeah i spent a lot of money on that website and i'm really excited to like get started and start talking about the pieces so i've actually um i've actually tried on all the pieces beforehand and i did the the filming try on bit that you'll see on the screen here i've i did that yesterday um just so i could get a feel of how the things fit so i can like talk about the sizing and the fit and everything like that so yeah without further ado i'm gonna start with the first piece so the first piece i'm gonna start with is these booty shorts now these are called the tofu aerobic shorts and i got these in a size let me move back a bit i got these in a size medium to large um because i think that's i think that said it was going to be like a 12 to 14 which is the size i am i love these i really love these i was like a bit worried about how they would fit because i've got quite my like my inner thighs are quite chubby and whenever i wear like quite short shorts like this i feel like they like ride right up and then they just look a bit crazy but i think they fit really well i mean i haven't worn them outside yet so i think it's a different story when you're like walking and do you know what i mean they kind of then ride up so i'm not sure about that but i do love them i think the color is gorgeous the color is absolutely stunning i love the like the boxer short detail i think these this style of short is really really popular right now um a lot of people are doing them and i think they're really 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 flattering they look really nice on they've got a nice thick waistband which is like again really flattering so yeah i think the shorts are really flattering they looked really good on they made me feel nice and secure um, I mean, they're not like, they don't pull me in or anything. They're not like really tight, but they do like make me feel, they made me feel really smoothed out and yeah, they're really stretchy. They're really, really nice fabric. They're, um, they're more of like a, what fabric is this? They're more, they feel more of like a gym leg, a gym, like a gym fabric than they do um just like normal jersey like the the shorts that i spoke about in my previous haul the sisters and seekers workout short they were like a in between like a gym wear slash jersey so they were an in between but this is more like proper gym wear but they don't look too gym wear like they're definitely wearable on a, like a day-to-day -day basis so these shorts were or are 34 pounds which it's quite expensive for a pair of shorts but i feel like that like sisters and seekers i mean they do have the odd piece that is like really really well priced and when i say well priced i mean cheap but other than that i think they are like not on the cheaper end i think they're more like mid mid range but i think it's completely worth the money i think they're really tr like trend setting and their fabrics are really amazing quality so it completely makes sense that the the pieces are not on the cheaper end so yeah these are 34.99 and i think they're really cute i really like them so the shorts have a matching bra top which is here I really, really love the look of the shorts and the bra top together. And I mean, I personally wouldn't usually buy bra tops like this because I just never think that they would fit properly. I've got quite big boobs. Um, as I've said, if you've watched my previous videos, I know I don't need to say it again because I say it a lot, but I have. And sometimes it is really hard to get pieces of clothing or bras that I actually fit into. So I was, I kind of, I wouldn't usually have got this in normal circumstances, but 
for this video i really wanted to get this to see what it looks like on me and just to see what the two look like together because on the model it looked really really good like really nice so i wanted to see what this looked like on so i got this in a size large and i mean it fit but I don't know how well, I mean, it's just like a, like a little sporty, like, bralette. I mean, it doesn't have a clippy back or anything. It does have adjustable straps, which is good, because you can, like, proper, like, pull it nice and tight to, like, lift your boobs up. But I think, like, these types of things, they only really work when you've got, like, smaller boobs that, like, kind of just stay there and don't really move um like you this is not the one if you're wanting to like have a supportive bra that like really like lifts you up and keeps you there it's just it's just this is not the one definitely not you'll be able to see what it looks like on i did actually get this in the other color in a smaller size so you'll be able to see the size difference i can put them together um once we get onto the neck on once we get onto that one but yeah i mean for like a i guess like a loungy wear type piece just around the house like maybe under hoodies or yeah that would really work but i think like i personally could not wear like i couldn't wear this on a night out like no way my boobs would just be all over the place but yeah so i got this in a size large and I think it's cute. I don't think I would wear it much at all, to be honest. But I'm glad that I got it to see what it looks like on and hopefully it will help you guys out with knowing what size to get. The, the shorts and the crop top bralette are both in exactly the same fabric. The fabric is really nice, it feels um, it doesn't feel cheap at all. It feels quite expensive. So it makes sense why it's a little bit on the pricier side. So the bra top was, or is, I keep saying was, the bra top is $24.99, which again, it's definitely not cheap, especially because this is quite a, like a dainty little piece. It's definitely not cheap, but the fabric is there, the quality is there. So it is worth the money, I would say. But yeah, that is the two first pieces, the crop and the shorts. Um, next is the same pieces, but in a different color. So these are the same shorts, but in the gray, I don't know what they call. So the other pieces were called, were the color tofu and these shorts are called onyx so this is the color onyx exactly the same but just different color really um i got the size medium to large again they fit exactly the same they look really nice when i first went online and was like picking the bits that i wanted to get i was only going to get this color because i don't know i'm just more of like a dark darker clothing girl i never really go for like whites or creams or like light colors ever i usually only go for darker pieces so this came to my attention first and then i was scrolling and i thought oh i might actually try the the cream or the the gray and actually i remember why i did get the cream and the gray because i wanted to pe i wanted to pair it with another piece that i'm going to talk about in a second um so yeah i thought i'd get the whole set to see what that looks like together but yeah i love these shorts they're they're so comfy so so comfy they're such nice shorts to like wear around the house but also to wear under t-shirt dresses. It's nice to get a different colored short that's not black. I'm always wearing black cycling shorts and it's nice to have like a different, a different color that's not as dark. So yeah, these are in a medium large, exactly the same as the gray, the cream ones. I don't know what color that is. It's like a light, a really light gray. Well, they call it tofu. Um, so yeah, that is the other pair of shorts. You'll be able to see what it looks like on. These were again 34.99. Did I say? 
Did I say that or didn't I say that? I'm not sure. Yeah, 34.99. Again, I really love this color. I've been really enjoying this like char, this light light charcoal grey colour recently. I think it is really nice, and it's definitely a really nice change from having everything in black, but it's still nice and dark. So yeah, love these shorts. And then again, I've got the matching top or bralette, which is here. So matching bralette, it has the sisters logo branding on the front which i think is a really nice placement um so i actually got this bralette in a smaller size so i got this in, in a medium um because i was intrigued to see the size difference i didn't know which which size was going to fit me i like i don't know why but i always think like oh my boobs aren't that big like I, i'll go with a medium and then so i put i put medium in my basket to start with and then when I was getting the cream one, I was like, maybe I'm not a medium. I always get medium or I always get like a smaller size and then get it. And I'm like, why did I get that? So I got the cream in a bigger size to see how, like the diff to see the difference in the fitting. And this is tiny, like tiny. I don't know if you'll be able to see in this clip, but I kind of had to, I never do like the whole under boob thing. Like it's a, it's a massive trend thing at the moment where you'll wear your bikini top or like bralette, like kind of on your boob and then you'll have a bit of under boob underneath. Um, and I had to do that with this because it was just the, just the cups are just absolutely tiny, but I think again if you didn't have big boobs like me and they like stayed in a nice place like maybe if they were fake or <laughs> do you know what i mean like boobs that just kind of stay there nicely i think this would like look really good on but it just doesn't really work for me i'm not gonna lie i don't I, like if i kept it i don't think i'd ever wear it because I like to have my I like my bras to be nice and supportive and kind of hold me in place and not like I just this is just not they're not going to work for me unfortunately but they are really nice and I'm glad that I got them to see what they look like on and hopefully to help you guys with knowing what size to get so I'll put up a side by side of the cream one and the grey one so you can see the size difference from the large to the medium so yeah that was the first first four pieces that i got and i'm really happy about the fabric is is gorgeous and the sets together look really really nice i'll show you like here i just think they look so nice on the models like really really nice so yeah that is what drew me to them is just it, they look really nice on the model and then they also come with these i didn't get the pouches but they also come with these little pouches that you clip onto here which i guess is just for kind of like like a little fashion accessory i guess but i just thought this outfit would be really cool for like a rave or like like a day thing i don't know i don't know but yeah i really like these two sets i think they're really cool just unfortunate that the bra isn't the one for me but i do think that they're stunning and would look amazing on so many of the people out there so next that brings me on to a piece that i got for the the tofu set this set and i mean it's not actually the same the exact same color but i picked up this little like cover up thing i don't know what they call it online let me have a look if i can find it because there's so much in this collection i'm having to like scroll the whole way through to see if i can find things okay it's just called um, a mini skirt it's called the eden mini skirt so this is just a skirt basically but it goes it's got an open an open side that you tie up with this little tie 
and it's i think it's to like be worn over bikinis like that's how they're wearing it the models are wearing it in the photo oh they look so amazing how amazing does that look so sick and such a good idea because i mean i haven't worn a bikini in so long but when i do i i get i get a little bit funny about like completely what ugh, the memory card i don't know why i just don't learn to clear my memory card before i start but anyway i was talking about this so i don't know what i was saying but basically when i wear bikinis um i like to wear a little cover-up thingy and i thought this was absolutely perfect so it's made out of swimming costume material so if you wanted you could literally wear this in the sea this does actually come with a matching like bikini but i didn't want to get the bikini because i just absolutely knew that it wouldn't fit and then like the tiniest little bottoms and i just i just i just knew that it wasn't ever going to fit me but i really really liked this i really like the idea of this and i thought this could look quite cool with the shorts like with these underneath is maybe like a i don't know i think these would that could be like quite a cool outfit to go out in and like a crop maybe not like out like day to day but do you know like night out rave ibiza type outfit i thought was really cool um so i tried this on with the shorts which hopefully you can see and i also tried it on with just my pants underneath and both looked really cool i really liked it so i got this in a size medium to large and i think it fits perfectly i mean i think any size that you'd get with this would fit because obviously you tie it at the waist so you can tie it how tight you want it but i really love this piece i can definitely see myself wearing this like over bikini or just over the top of some shorts or as i said like over the top of those shorts i think it looks really cool so yeah this is in more of like a cream color i don't know if you can see the difference but this is more like gray and this is more actual cream but I really love the colours of both of these. I think they're stunning. So yeah, that was that. This is called the... Did I already say? Eden... Yeah, I did. I did. I did. The Eden mini skirt. And this was £30. And it also comes with a matching bikini. So having the full set, I think, would look sick. But just not on me. So yeah, that is that. I love that. Next, let's move on to the trousers or the suit so i'll start with the trousers actually no i'll start with the blazer so next i picked up this blazer this is in the same color as the first set that i spoke about so in the color onyx um this is just like a standard blazer really the fabric is really nice and thick like a really heavy twill fabric um it's got the i don't even know what it says there it says sisters and then it says business as usual how to be a powerhouse woman at work um and it just has that little writing at the front like on the side here um, and yeah, this is just kind of like a basic blazer. And I mean, I'm going to be honest, it's not my preferred style of blazer. When I put it on, I was kind of like, oh, it's a little bit long for, ha well, I mean, so it said on the website, it said, um, get your size if you wanted it to be fitted. If you want it to be oversized, get a size or two sizes bigger so i got a size 16 in this and i'm usually 12 and i mean it's definitely oversized but i feel like it's it because it's a fitted blazer it's got shape to it it kind of just felt a bit too shaped i prefer my blazers to be nice and straight so then they feel more oversized and then it was a bit long and i feel like if i went bigger it would just be even longer and 
yeah, it just wouldn't really fit the way that I'd want my blazer to fit. However, I did try it on as a dress and I think as a dress it looked really, really good and I'd 100% wear that out, um, especially with the little, well not little, it's really chunky, like puffy, um, what do you call this, belt tie thing that you tie around the middle. I think the tie with the around the blazer as like a going out outfit looked really nice with like some boots oh, i just thought with my big like knee high chunky flat boots with that as a dress with the blazer as a dress and the tie and then underneath it i wore just my normal black bra that would look so sick i need to get a photo in that but yeah anyway as an actual like blazer to wear like i don't know with other outfit like like not as a dress it's not my preferred style of blazer but i do really like the blazer i really like the color of it i really love this um like little worded detail it sort of reminds me of like your school blazer with that kind of looks like a like your school logo badge type thing but i do really like it it's just not my preferred style of blazer so yeah i got this in a size 16 you'll be able to see what it looks like on and i'll get the name of it for you now so this is the powerhouse blazer in in oxide i think that's the name oxide so it's more or less the same color as the first shorts that i showed uh, actually these shorts with that blazer and that bra top would actually be another really sick outfit i'm gonna have to try that on after this but yeah i do really like the blazer it's just not my preferred style but it might be yours so you never know i'm glad that i got it to try it on and this was 64.99 so quite pricey which makes me feel like i'm not gonna keep it i don't think because it's on the pricier side and i think if me personally if i was gonna pay that much for a blazer i'd want it to be spot on like spot on with the size and the fit and this just isn't for me and it would definitely be for other people 100 percent. it's just not my preferred style of fit for a blazer so yeah but i do really like it and i think it looks really cool especially as a dress so yeah i need to decide on that one because i do really like it as a dress but we'll see anyway moving on to the next piece which is the matching trousers now the trousers this is what they look like they're your kind of basic, like, normal kind of leg trouser. They have the sisters logo embroidered here. So on the blazer, it was printed. And on the trousers, it's embroidered. Just your normal kind of, you've got a a button to do them up like this and then you clip that like that it literally felt like i was going to school when i was putting these on then you do the zip up now i really really struggled to get these on and once i had them on they just did not look great at all you'll be able to see what they look like on here i got these in a size 12 and that is my size i think everywhere usually everywhere a size 12 fits me but these i mean they fit like i could get them on but they just looked awful like the pockets because they were really tight and they don't have any stretch the pockets were just like open you'll be able to see what it looks like and my my body was just felt like they were bulging out of them they were so tight around my legs like at the top of my legs here around my thighs um and yeah it was just a shame really they have a really nice detail on the bottom this like zip so you can have them obviously open 
or you can have them closed as like normal trousers these would be really cool as like a work trouser if work would let you wear the logo like this but if say if like i feel like if i like having a job within fashion i think that this is like a really cool work trouser it's just such a shame that they don't fit and i mean i don't know whether a size 14 would fit because maybe they'd fit better around my top area but they were these were already really really long like i'd have to wear chunky like platform shoes for them to not drag on the floor or i'd have to be taking them up which i mean would be really easy except there's a zip there so maybe not i just have to i could only take them up by like an inch which wouldn't really do much so yeah it's a shame with that one i don't think i would have picked these anyway i'm not really the type of person to wear trousers i haven't worn a pair of trousers in in years but i wanted to see what they looked like on because i had a little feeling that they weren't going to fit me properly but i just wanted to try them on and see what they'd look like fit like on my body and yeah they just they just didn't really fit very well, which is the same. What I do want to say, though, is they made my bum look so nice and round. I was pretty I was pretty happy about that. I'm not going to lie. They made my bum look really nice and round and juicy. But it's just a shame that they didn't fit nice all over. Maybe a 14 would fit better. I really don't know. It's really, really hard to tell. But they are a really cool, a cool trouser. I really love the... Um, the split zip detail at the bottom to like have them open and then wear like chunky trainers i think that'd look really cool but yeah they're not for me unfortunately which is quite sad so yeah next piece is this now when i first thought that i was gonna order some bits from sisters and seekers this was the f this was like the first thing that i thought i'm definitely getting that defo and it's this dress how cool is that it's got little well not little they're quite big ants all over it and i mean ants are like my least favorite thing especially flying ants disgusting but I thought it looked really cool. You never ever see an ant print on anything. And I just think it was really sick. Like I really love that it's mesh. So like you can completely see through it. So you'd have to wear like, I don't know, a bikini under it. Or on the website actually they wore shorts. I'll see if I can find it. Um, so this is them wearing it with shorts so they're wearing it with these shorts and then the cream bikini top that goes with that um skirt oh not that that goes with the little skirt this skirt it's inside out but you know what i mean so they're wearing the bikini top underneath and the shorts and i think that looks really really sick um i also tried it on with the sh with just my pants and then i also tried it on with the shorts so you can kind of see what it looks like with both but i think it's really really cool i love the fabric feels really nice the mesh is really really soft there's nothing worse than having a mesh that's really tough and and horrible but this is like nice and stretchy it's really it was really really flattering and i think it would be so sick with if you are familiar with any events in ibiza there's an event on i think it's a wednesday i've never been so i don't know but there's an event called ants and i mean i think you're meant to wear black but i think this would be so cool because obviously there's ants on it so yeah i really love this i think it looks so good with the shorts i've never seen anyone wear like a mesh dress with cycling shorts underneath so i really love that because sometimes you don't really want to have your whole bum out so it's just a different way to wear it and i think it looked really cool um oh forgot to say how much the trousers were sorry so bad at this i'm really bad at this so the trousers were 
$49.99. That is quite pricey, 50 quid for the trousers. Yeah, I definitely, I'm not gonna keep them anyway, but that is expensive for a pair of trousers. But yeah, that's how much the trousers were. And then this was $27.99, which I'm more than happy to pay for. 27.99 for i think it's really really cool i love the color of the mesh as well it's like not cream it's like the same color as as these shorts like the same type of yeah it's probably like more or less exactly the same color it's like a greeny a greeny creamy gray color but yeah i absolutely love this i think it looks so good on and i'm really excited to wear this out i think like underneath a black blazer with the shorts oh, with the shorts, this black bra or like the, a cream bra and then a blazer and then chunky boots. Oh, so sick. So yeah, I absolutely love this. I got this in a size 12 and it fit perfectly. I think I wouldn't want it any other size. And yeah, I think it's really, really, it looked really, really flattering on. I really liked it and I really can't wait to wear this. I love it. Next, let's go for these. These were another two pieces that I thought I definitely want these two pieces when I order the stuff. <laughs> the stuff. Um, so we'll start with these shorts. These are the social distancing shorts in white. They only come in white, but yeah, I love these which also i may as well talk about the next piece which also match with the white social distancing tank top has the same logo there these two together look amazing i've seen quite a few people wear these on instagram and they just look so sick um so yeah the shorts so i got a size where's the label I got a size 12 in these and they fit but the waistband is extremely um like tight like it really pulls you in so they do fit but I think you should be able to see that like they kind of squeeze my tummy and then my fat roll like hangs over the top of them if I'm not standing up straight and I mean I don't really sit up straight that often like when i'm actually relaxing my it just they just don't look very flattering which is such a shame so i think i'm going to order the next size up in these so the 14 and hopefully they'll be a bit bigger on the waistband because yeah they just it just didn't look that great but i do love them i love the placement of the embroidery like right in the center of the shawl and then the matching top as well just looks so sick together like really sick so the shorts were are i keep saying were the shorts are 36.99 it's quite expensive i need to stop saying that because I need, I need to just get over the fact that this is not the cheapest of brands but yeah 36.99 for the shorts i do love them they are they do feel really good quality i'm just so scared because they're white and i never really wear white clothes because i'm just so scared of getting them dirty but i need to get over my fear because i think these are so cool and then with the tank top it just looks so good so yeah this tank top i got in a size 12 and it fit perfectly when i put this on which, oh my God, can I say, was an absolute mission to get over my head. Yesterday, my hair was like this. So I had my hair up and then I had a full face of makeup on, trying to get this over my head without getting makeup on it. Oh my God, it was such a mission. I'm trying to see if I've got any on, but I think I did pretty well. I can see a few bits, but... I was literally like, I had to just ruin my hair at the end to just get it on because I needed to try it on for this video. But the fit of this is really, really nice. This is like the thickest ribbed material I've ever felt. Like it really, really um, like held me in. It made, it was, it's so comfortable. Like I really, I was so shocked when I put this on. I thought, 
oh this is not going to be very flattering on me because i'm not like a huge fan of my arms i think they're quite big and i was thinking ugh, like this i feel like this is going to make my arms look really big but i really like the way it kind of it kind of brought me all in so it like held my boobs in place and and like with the shorts as well it just looked so sick so i was really really happy with this and i'm obsessed with the fit like i really really loved the fit um so yeah i got this in a size 12 and this was 22.99 which is not bad at all i think that's a an amazing price for such a really good quality tank top um and then they also have to match this is these i don't know how much these are but these like i don't know what they're called these like cap things which also have the social distancing logo on and like the full outfit together just looks so cool i just absolutely love it and obviously we're all having to social distance right now or we're meant to be so yeah i just think it was really cool and i feel like these are like pieces that you like i'm gonna keep forever to like show my kids like back when i was 23 like we were in a global pandemic and we all had to social distance and at that time i got these shorts and this tank top from sisters and seekers and i still got it do you know what i mean like it's that type of thing that i feel like i'll keep forever so yeah i absolutely love these especially this top i love the fit of this top and i think it will go with everything absolutely everything the shorts will go with other things the tank top will go with other things together they look amazing and i love it so much next i think we're on to our last few things actually let me grab this so sisters and seekers always come out with the best t-shirts so i picked up this oh it's called the boy band t-shirt and it has this like am i meant to know these people that isn't like an actual boy band is it or am i just being really stupid i don't think it is but it's called the boy band t-shirt anyway it's got that printed on and it says sisters there and it's really cool so i just picked it picked this up thinking it was a normal t-shirt and then when i tried it on which again can i say if you get this t-shirt please put it on before you get ready because oh my gosh this head hole is not tiny well it is it was so hard to get over my head it's not stretchy in the slightest and just has absolutely no give in it whatsoever so i was literally had to just drag it over my head and i was extremely upset because i'd done my makeup and i'd done my hair and it was absolutely ruined after i put this t-shirt on however once the t-shirt was on it was a stunning fit i do love a really high neck t-shirt and this was just it like it fit really nicely and then yeah when i had it on i realized that it actually has pockets oh which i think is a really nice feature um usually i don't really like it when t-shirts have pockets i always think like uh like that look just is just not needed but i think it's a really nice feature like especially to put your hands in the pockets like if you're having a photo i think would look really cool again i think this was slightly too short to wear as a dress i did get it to wear as a t-shirt slash a dress like i did in my other haul um with the doberman t-shirt but yeah it they they're both just a bit short to wear as a dress which is fine um because you can wear like the the gray cycling shorts underneath and they're like more or less the same color so they'd go but yeah this the quality of this t-shirt is stunning like it's a really really nice thick fabric like now that we're going into winter it's a really nice fabric nice thick heavy duty fabric for a t-shirt going into winter i think this would look really cool with like oh like my wide leg jeans and then like a little bit tucked in and then my gray 
Yeezys. I think that'd be a really cool outfit. Or what else could you wear it with? Chunky boots or again cycling shorts trainers you could wear it with a blazer cycling shorts trainers or boots like anything i think you always need a t-shirt dress or a t-shirt a large baggy t-shirt in your wardrobe and this is just really cool and the print i think this is like a really popular piece from this collection um and i feel like all their t-shirts do really well because they come up with the best print to put on the front but yeah this was in the size extra large yeah extra large and it fit perfectly i really love uh, love i really love the fit of it and this was is i keep saying was i mean is this is 37.99 i think it's that expensive because it's got the pockets and obviously the print like for production wise that makes it a bit more expensive but i absolutely love this i think it looked really cool i was quite surprised with this one because i thought oh just another t-shirt dress but i did really like the fit of it when i tried it on it's nice and wide i love a wide baggy t-shirt so yeah love this i think it's really cool and then i think we're on to the last piece from this collection let me just grab it ah so this one is really cute i really like what is on this so this is a hoodie a gray a dark gray hoodie and on the front it says make hugging great again which is so cute because again it's referring back to the pandemic and the fact that we have to be social distanced and we're not meant to hug people um, and yeah, I think it's really, really cute. And again, brings us back to this time when we're in this, when we are in this huge pandemic, which hopefully we're seeing the back of now. But yeah, love this jumper. I think even like, even whatever it would say on there, I think the, how it's laid out, like on the cream background, is really cool i think it looks really nice i really love this gray color i don't have anything this is like an in-between charcoal slash like ash gray i haven't i don't think i have anything this color in my wardrobe so yeah i really love this jumper it's a really nice fit i got this in a size extra large to large and it fits perfectly nice and oversized which is exactly how i like my hoodies and yeah, that was $34.99 for the hoodie, which again is a decent price to pay for a good quality hoodie that was definitely needed as we are kind of going more into autumn and winter. So yeah, freaking love this. Such a cute jumper. Love the embroidery. And yeah, so that was actually everything that I got from this collection i don't even think i said what this collection is called but this is the i think it's called so this is the wealth and well-being collection it's their newest collection that they've brought out and i think they've absolutely smashed it i think it is such an amazing collection there's so many pieces there were so many more pieces that i want to get um so many color well there's like different color variations so like the blazer and the trousers that also comes in a cream color like the cream bikini that i was talking about that also comes in gray um there's so many color variations for the different pieces and there was just so many other pieces that i could have picked up but i could not pay any more than i did because i literally broke the bank getting all this stuff but yeah they absolutely smashed this collection i think they've done such an amazing job they are always coming out with trend setting pieces that you don't see anywhere else like they are setting the trends and i read their like about page earlier and it said in there that they are trend they're a trend setting brand and i couldn't agree more like they're coming out with just the most like simple but creative pieces and i just think they're absolutely smashing at the moment and definitely one of my favorite brands so yeah oh last thing which i probably shouldn't show in this haul because it's not in this collection but 
if you watched my previous haul that I had the few bits from Sisters and Seekers, I was talking about the workout collection and I got the jumper, which I got in a medium to large and I wasn't sure on the sizing. So when I did this order, I picked up the large to extra large in that hoodie, which is here. And I have tried on for you guys. Um, we've all seen this jumper before. I tried it in my previous haul. But yeah, as I said, I've got this in a in a large in a medium to large and i thought it was a bit small so i wanted to try the large to extra large but i actually think that i prefer the medium to large sizing which i was really shocked about i put this on and i just thought hmm this is a bit big and i actually really liked how the medium to large fitted i didn't think i did at the time but i really do now comparing it to this so i'll put a side by side of the two sizes next to each other so you can kind of see the difference but yeah i just thought i'd pop that in there as well to hopefully help you help you guys out so yeah that is everything i got from sisters and seekers i hope you enjoyed this video i really enjoyed filming it and trying all the pieces on i absolutely love filming hauls as you can probably tell i filmed a lot of them if there are any other brands or collections that you would want me to like get and try on and haul for you guys then let me know in the comments down below um again if you have any suggestions for any of the videos you want me to do then please let me know in the comments and if you haven't subscribed then please do it really really helped me out and i'd really appreciate it leave me a comment leave me a like and with that being said thank you so much for watching this video and i'll see you in my next one Bye bye